Today, we celebrate the 50-year anniversary of Apollo 11 and those who take on the world's greatest challenges. Quality base here. The Eagle has landed. Not a three footer. Very few know more about this spirit of exploration than Buzz Aldrin, the second man to walk on the moon. Beautiful view. You know uh, what's special about that picture? Three words location, location, location. <laughs> <laughs> It just looked so totally lifeless that you couldn't describe it in any way, but a word that comes close is desolate. You can see that, I think, clearer in, in what you have. Some time ago, NVIDIA had an opportunity to show Buzz an interactive real-time recreation using advanced graphics capabilities. Today, powerful new NVIDIA RTX technology is bringing these details to life like never before. We can render the lunar lander and its surroundings with stunning levels of realism and simulate how the sun's rays react to every surface in real time. This ability to play with light and shadow gives us incredible new perspectives on the moon landing. Each of us, we're gonna test the gravity and our strength and our ability to get back in again. That's a pretty good jump. When I jumped back up, I uh, underestimated me and overestimated the gravity. A little more, but another inch. You're doing a technical analysis of this, which uh, shows a new interpretation, and it catches my attention. 50 years later, Apollo 11's historic achievement still inspires new generations of moonshots. I got a good photo that you could uh, work on next. It's called the first selfie in space. <laughs> <laughs>